you ever too nervous to ask questions in class? Are you ever scared of the large amount of people surrounding you? Well, students in big classrooms are, and today I'll show you how smaller classes are more effective than larger ones. Smaller class sizes are proven to enhance the student's learning capability. With a smaller classroom, where it can be specifically fitted to what the class needs most. In smaller numbers, the teacher can tailor their approach according to the learning styles of the group. The student can tell the teacher that they have already learned the subject and that they are ready to move on. In a smaller classroom, if only a few students don't comprehend the material, the teacher can meet with these students much easier than many people in a larger classroom. Smaller classrooms are more efficient in their work because there's less people to teach, thus less people don't understand the material. Fremont College says, students receive more feedback from instructors because faculty have more time to devote to reading their students' assignments and providing feedback. This is saying that teachers have more time to work on each specific student's work in smaller classrooms instead of rushing through them all due to a high number of students. In a smaller classroom, the teacher can get to know the students better than in a large classroom because they can spend more time helping each student. Because of this, the teacher can know what student is great and not so great at. In a smaller classroom, the assignments can be more hands-on than a larger classroom. The student can do the work instead of just having to learn it much more effectively because of the smaller class size. Hands-on work in a large classroom would take too much time out of the class period. This would lower the efficiency. A study in 2009 by Purdue University taught middle school students about the effect of humans on water quality. This study took a poll and a group of students who did hands-on learning comprehended the material better than the group who just learned the traditional lecture way. This hands-on way of teaching would not have been possible in a larger classroom. Smaller classrooms make better use of time and can move through material faster because there will be less amount of people that do not comprehend the material. Small classrooms also encourage participation in activities. In a small class, the teacher can tell who is working and not working easier than in a large learning environment. If there was a large amount of students, how could the teacher keep an eye on everyone? This means that the less amount of students, the less amount of slackers. Students can also ask the teacher specific questions about the material much easier because students will have less questions. The more people, the more questions. The more questions, the more time spent. Summing this up, small classrooms are simply just more practical and efficient than larger ones. Work is done more efficiently and quickly. The instructor can cater to each student's specific needs better, and the teacher can also keep an eye on every student, which increases the overall participation. All of these things you see would be close to impossible in a larger classroom. Thank you.